Alright. Let's see puppies. Clean. That's gonna go in there. Looks good. Hmm. Dang. I wanna fingerprint these up. So, let's see. That one. Nope, that way. Man. You don't have to make room. Guys, so we've got our gas pedal and brake, which is one piece on the GTO held together by these two welds. So I'm just gonna cut this since we're cut right here. Since this is the flat piece, I already started, but I'm gonna keep going. So what we got to do right now is we got to get the gas pedal out of there. So we're trying to put this puppy in there and this puppy's really long and the spring's kind of tired. So I'm thinking what we might do is we might shorten this a smidge for a couple of reasons. I realize that because it's going to be closer to the fulcrum, it's going to be harder but it's also gonna have less movement, which is fine by me. Like, 
I just gotta be cognizant of how much I'm shortening it, but the factory one is really short. But I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can take this out. Yeah, so you saw me trying to fit it on there. There's like a pedestal down here. This is all the way to that outside of the driver's side of the door. So it has the room to be able to pedal it. There's a pedal all the way down to the floor. Like maxed out there. But we want to go up so that we have a little bit more room. Also, if you know anybody, one's Cusco pedal. And the uh, Denso accelerator. Let's go. So I've shortened it. If I can zoom out on this thing. So I've shortened it. Now I'd like to bend it, like right where I made this dot. So, see that dot right there? I'd like to bend it, but I'm gonna see how easy that's gonna be. I think we're gonna try and mount the oil filter. I'm thinking it's, I wanna put it like right here, angled down so that it can access everything from the bottom. That's plastic and I don't wanna put it there. That's frame, I don't wanna put it there. There's not many spots I can put it. And this is my guy, so I could probably put it, actually I might be able to put it like right over here somewhere. I don't want to get in the way of the fan shroud or anything like that. So let's see what we can do. So basically, I have one of the hose mounted, the other one just kind of lying there, um, just to kind of see how much room I have. But 
what I'm thinking is going to happen is I'm going to probably end up mounting it somewhere over here. I don't really want to mount it in the frame, but there's two grounding holes, bolts right here. I'm not sure if I want to do that or not. There's another mount right here, but again, I got to be careful because my, my radiator is going to be coming out. I don't want to hit my radiator shroud. I think that would be an awesome location just because, you know, you got room, but again, I got to think about cable management here or, you know, oil line management because look how much slack I have. I mean, these things are pretty long. So I'm um, considering another location, maybe put it lower down and angled to the ground so that I can just drain the oil and pull this puppy off from the bottom. I don't know. I'm tossing the ideas around. We'll see.